being, we call it soul or conscience. When we speak of the creator of our soul, we refer to the Heavenly Mother in Chinese she is called Lao Mu. All I left the above are one and the same. 当我们从他作为宇宙之本源而言，称他为道，在他作为一切之主宰而言，我们称他为理。当他在我们体内，使我们生存并支配肉体时，我们称他为灵性或良心。因为它赋予我们本性，我们称它为老。这些名称虽异而其义相同，皆指同一物而言。now, what you have actually received is the Tao. Tao is everybody as true self. Today you had been initiated by the teacher and the door of your mind has been opened. Now you are able to understand that the body is not your true self. The body is controlled by the Tao within you. 现在你们的的就是道，道是每一个人的真我。今天你们遇的名师指点开了心窍，现在你认识了肉体并非真正的你，而灵性才是真正的你，那位无情无相的。然而在支配你的身体的灵性。while you are alive your soul dwells within your body. As soon as the soul leaves your body you are dead. Your soul is from God, but your physical body is from your parents. You already had the Tao within you yet did not realize it. Therefore, you have had to search for it and had now been fortunate enough to find a teacher who is able to transmit it to you. Previously you believed that the physical body was your true self and behaved accordingly. You were selfish, committing mischiefs, acts of violence, and overindulging in physical pleasures. This condition repeatedly led you into a reincarnation and endless sufferings. Now you understand that your true self is not your physical body but only use the body as a vehicle. You are not limited to this physical body. You are boundless. You are the master of the universe because you have God as essence within you. You are full of mercy and love because you share of God as spirit. Most people today have forgotten all these spiritual characteristics and do not know who they really are. Today you are regaining your conscience, your true self. 他立刻就死亡，灵性附于天，而肉体由父母而来。因此，事实上，我们已有道在身上，为何还要再寻求他？还要有点。